This is round four between 12th Vagan Rangers and Wolverines Reborn. This is what I think is map one, TC Boggs, Bob and a Vulture Delta with large beam lasers and some missiles, Dimos and some type of Morogu coming up on the edge. Let's call that an auto cannon for now. Serial Mascot in what I think is a triple UAC-2 or UAC-5 Puma against them and you really can't see it the camera angle is a bit weird on this one kentax is in some sort of masakari Hiroshima is in something with ppcs and ux and i i never get a really good look at snow gibbon i think snow gibbon might have some mrms and this is just we come in bob sees them Dimos sees them and they just start unloading their firepower from range that masakari is is it's just too slow and they're in the, and wr is entrenched there's no good way for them to for 12th to approach here and so they they start trading and i think that they want to focus on Dimos's morigu but they just can't figure out a way to approach you can see that they, they have the 12th yard has the range to exchange but i just think that this comes down to bob getting so many excellent hits and and, and getting out of 12th's firing arc and uh and, and 12th kind of freezes up here a little bit trying to figure out where to go as it seems like snow given actually has atms or lrms um wasn't able to quite figure out um this the bracket on uh, the c bill bracket on this map but it's very interesting because we just sit here in, in 12th and and wr exchange but you're you've got this morgu eating up your missiles with its lambs you've got bob just surgically firing away his entire inventory of weapons at you and i think ultimately that 12th had a good strategy here i think 12th might have even had perhaps the stronger list uh, but that wr just counters any time that 12th tries to move left or right on your screen here and and ultimately the WR between Dimos and Bob does a good job of covering both flanks. And I was a bit surprised that 12th Yard didn't just try to back up out, uh, out of the positioning on this. We joined the map so late. I don't know if time's an issue. Uh, I don't know anything else. But I just know that uh, that 12th does a good job of exchanging on the Morgu. But Bob gets so largely untouched in this map. It, it, it is nuts. Bob in top form here from everything that we can see. And, and to be fair to 12th, I mean, you, we can barely, we can see their weapons, and that's about it. So we don't have the, the complete information. They're doing a lot of damage to Dimos, but Bob gets the kill there. And then the rest of this match is crazy, frankly, because you've still got two pretty good assets. Whatever Snow Gibbons in, he's doing a good job of trading. And Kentax uh, got a lot of firepower, but he has to be careful because he's going to be the focus. And, and WR just has the patience here. They continuously sit back, uh, work their weapons range, and, 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 and really prevent 12th from being able to focus on, on anything in particular. But uh, the interesting thing about this map comes up here pretty soon, and it's Snow Given gets a really, really nice shot, and they just needed, they needed more of what Snow Given just did there of not taking damage, getting a good shot off on the Morgu. And now you can see Bob telling Damos and Serial Mascot, screen me a little bit. We're going to move in a bit closer, and, and let's let's finish this fight. So slowly moving in, that Masakari uh, has unbelievable firepower for an 85-ton mech, so, and, and Dimos has taken a good amount of damage, so they're they're gonna they're gonna move up together. And Bob, I think, is is largely fresh in this match, but ultimately, from what I can ultimately what I can tell, it's just you can see there the PPC UAC Bob like okay, I've got some armor, let's trade a little bit. Gets in position, gets some ATMs off here, gets some get some beam lasers and it's just a, a chess match trying to move their assets i think bob's team uh, had some better maneuverability i can't believe i'm saying that about a morgu but here's the problem you see kentax has crashed bob doesn't quite realize it yet and and so uh bob's just going okay well kentax isn't firing uh, i don't know why but i'm, I'm gonna start focusing on snow given and then just the rest of the match uh, kentax crashes at a, at a crucial point and i think that the way they ended up handling this was that if necessary they would play a map four but you see kentax has crashed and that was just kind of kind of the end of it Yoshima's was like okay well i guess we're still we're let's go ahead and fight this, this thing's probably over anyway and bob's just like nah that's all right let's uh 
let's just call this one a, a, a victory for, for us for right now and we'll throw out the map if we need to and uh, that's what happens so for now WR up one uh, wins this one but uh, where it counts and where it leads us we'll see in the next map